Sarah's got a great sense of humor. When she's happy about something, it's pretty infectious the way that she laughs. And it, uh, it really catches me. My career started in 2000 in the military. That following December, we were married. Sarah and Steve would go on to make their home in more than seven army posts around the world. When we first moved over to Germany, we had our oldest, who was about six months at the time. And then about three months later, I was deployed to Afghanistan. We had our second baby, Sophia. She was born approximately two weeks before my second deployment, this time to Iraq. Number three, Veronica came along, and two weeks later, I was again back to Iraq. Baby number four, Luke comes along. About a year later, we went on my fourth deployment. So Luke just made two years old by the time I left. It was always easier for me on the deployments, easier for me than her, I think, because I just had to take care of myself. Sarah was amazing the way that she was able to take care of the kids and keep them safe, keep them fed, and continue to be a great mom to them. Just this past January, while on a training mission at Fort Campbell, Kentucky, Steve and three of his fellow soldiers were injured when their helicopter crashed. I wake up and I'm outside the aircraft and I, I, I can't feel my legs. When I really finally came to, Sarah was there and she was smiling at me. I was a mess, broken arm, broken leg, broken rib, multiple burns. And Sarah basically moved into the hospital with me. We've been through a lot and it's just, um, I couldn't have done it without her. Um, it's a difficult time, but she's, she's the one that helped me. You know, we, we made it through together. And uh, I love her and I love her. My mom's a hero. I love you, mom. I love you, mom. I love you and thank you for all you do. I love you, mommy. Trader family, please come up here, guys. Trader family, come on up. you signed up for today. Not really, no. Right? All right, so um, we have a little bit of a surprise for you. You're a super mom. Yes. <laughs> I just do what needs to be done. I don't know. Beautiful you family. Are too. Beautiful. <laughs> we asked your husband how we could help honor you, and he told us you needed a little R&R. &R. Rest, <laughs> relaxation. Would that, you like that? That, that yes. would be nice. Would that be nice for you? I won't say no. Well, Sarah, <clears throat> you're getting it. <laughs> Our friends at Sheridan Grand here in Nashville are sending you and your husband on a five-night vacation at their sister property in Santa Monica, California, oh, the luxurious yeah. Oceana Beach Club Hotel. This place, by the way, is insane. Oh, well, thank you. And uh, Kelly and Jesse, I, I say we keep going. What do you say, guys? You want to give I, some more I, stuff? I, I say. Audience, should we give them some more oh, stuff? Yeah. Friends at ConAgra. Those are the folks who stock so many of our kitchens. They wanted to fill your pantry with $5,000 worth of ConAgra food brands. Yes. <laughs> they believe everyone has the right to good nutrition and food. Yes. Kids, what do you think of all this stuff? It's pretty cool, right? Yeah. Yeah, fun. <laughs> you, you guys kind of feel left out, don't you? <laughs> kind of nice if you got some stuff. No. Yeah, you can say it. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Sarah Conagra has something special for all the kids. They are too. giving mm -hmm. each one of your children, check this out, $5,000 to help with their education. <laughs> each one, $5,000. Thank you. How do you guys feel? Oh, that is an even scratch the surface for reward, I know, because you deserve so much more. It's very generous. I mean, we're so appreciative. and. It's so nice that people recognize military families, and, and thank you so much. Well, we thank, thank you, you. Yeah. seriously. And we thank you, of course, for everybody. Amazing. How are you feeling? I feel like great. This, this has been wonderful. Are you excited to go to Santa Monica and hang out by the beach for a little bit? Oh, absolutely. Bit? <laughs>